Uh, I think I've just done the what I do sometimes. I think I switched the camera off, but I haven't. So apparently, child says it's not because of the chocolate. It's because it's the last day of the holiday. Ah. So I'll give it a good smack if that's all I do. Oh no, it's not. She's off again. I think she'll be having um, locked in the back bedroom pretty soon. So what did they ever do with us when we were young and before all that inventions to keep us quiet? Can't remember, it's about 30 years ago that. Alright, we're at the end of Fleet Dyke, or the start of Fleet Dyke. <coughs> And we've just had the, do you remember Little Britain? When they used to get out of the wheelchair. Matt Lucas, when Molly Humsey's back returned. There's always something to be happening. But Erin's just flew straight over, right the way over my head. Got into the water at the back and pulled a decent sized roach out. I would say half a pound at least. So that's twice I've seen them diving into the water. Don't, don't normally see that. No, well, I haven't seen it very much, I don't think. I normally just see them loitering on the edge, waiting patiently. Times must be hard. They've got to compete with the cormorants and otters, haven't they? I've seen plenty of cormorants, no otters. You might see a kingfisher up down. Um, Lime Kiln Dyke, if we go down there, or around it. Sometimes there's some around um, Gay Staff. Yeah, so it's St. Bennett's Abbey. A few boats have set off because it was full this yesterday when we came down. Tide is falling, low water around here is about 10 o'clock. It's now half past eight ish. Mm. Turn away. There's a favourite sweetie pie, did you get the sunglasses from me, do you? Um, Good question. Pretty dark these sunglasses, you don't need to tell her. And when I went into the bedroom the other day to go to the toilet, I thought I'd open the toilet door, but it was the bedroom door that swung back to the toilet door, and I walked into the toilet door. Mm. Oh, we just saw a Royal Velvet 2 in Fleet Dyke there, which is the boat that Colette and Carl will be on, and Karen. Um, I did get, I'm not going to tell you this story or not, I did get a message from Samantha, who'd been on it. 
and said the berth in the lounge in the saloon isn't really suitable for an adult it's not got to be good for carrying because she's got a huge backside um, but if you remember from February Karen was off internet dating with a guy called Phil from who was buying a house in Potterayam so we reckon she'll just come down in the car and spend one night on the boat and then she'll spend the rest of the time with him I might be wrong um, uh, get a bit of a wiggle on what's on that? stuck behind two boats <laughs> if they are going up the ant Yeah, so um, we get at like our turnaround days now the Friday, so we come down on the 29th of July and they come down on the 30th of July and um, and we're just going to head down to Aircle Bridge and wait from there, we might have to double more that night and then on the, that'll be Saturday the 30th on the Sunday oh I didn't go into Ulton Broad yesterday and book them, did I? I booked Beckles <laughs> I meant to do that yesterday but um, me and Sam ended up playing pool um, so I must remember to do that Yeah, so that'll be Sunday at Ulton Broad, Monday at Beckles, another snooker session, and then probably Tuesday at Loddon again. I don't know whether they're planning on going up to Wadden Norwich, I don't know. But that's age off yet. Still got all day today and tomorrow until 2 o'clock. Well, li literally, what will happen is we booked in at Bolters. R12. We're going out the fuel and the and pump out, get the boat cleaned, and then as soon as we're ready, we'll get gone. So it probably will be around about two o'clock. I just took two painkillers. Why did I do that last night? They had a headache all night. Should have done it last night. It's gone now. I'm keeping my hat on today. I'm going to put some sun cream on. It's going to be sunny again all day today. Right. We'll have a look when we get to the bridge marker. Just over eight foot. You will get through no problem, even with my big head stuck up here. Yeah, it should be nice and quiet here, I'm guessing, while well, I'm hoping. Not the usual wacky races. That'll be, what day are we on? Thursday. Mm, that could be tomorrow when we're coming back down here. Well, I don't know about that, because we don't have to have an early start, do we? It's about, what is it now, from St. Neatstead to Orings, about two and a quarter hours. We're booked in at half twelve, so we'll have to set off till quarter past ten if we don't want. By that time, any Friday handovers will have gone back, won't they? But it could be busy this afternoon if we decide to come back down this way. 
Not, um, not a problem. Now I'm going to see if I can fly my drone today. Might do the walk at Neat said. Hmm. Couldn't do it yesterday. There's no way I was flying it off the boat. <laughs> Not the chance. Um, then it's been a bit breezy a couple of days. Oh, I hope they don't see this mistake, they always give me a bit of grief about that. I didn't know she was a prostitute when I was trying to book a massage. She did send me an address in Norwich though. It said if you're ever in Norwich, pop in for a chat. I think I deleted that though. Going under the bridge now, Eliza. In a minute. Don't climb up there, please. Don't climb up there. Can you see through the window? Cookie. Pardon? It is quite warm, yeah. It's not too bad. There's no wind, is there? It's a very gentle breeze. It's on my app, on the Met Office, it's showing sunny all day. It's only got to be 14 degrees, but that's all it was yesterday. And I got burnt, so... Somebody's watching you. Eight foot three. <coughs> There's been a few bump the sides going under here. Because when it's really windy, you know, you can see the scuff marks down the side. She's not going to be here now, is she, this time, Lisa? I don't know what she found funny about the bridge. Something tickled her. I might send her a message tomorrow telling her what time we're going under the bridge. She has caught Silver Cloud on camera before, but not while we've been on it. Yeah, then. Ludden Bridge. I bet you could guess that, couldn't you, really? I'm going to stop doing these videos, I think. They're all the same, aren't they? I'm going to have to come up with something new. It's a bit difficult, though, isn't it? You're just cruising up the river and going to various places. A lot of, not a lot much you can do different. 
the only thing is, it is different every season because you can see the green shoots now just starting to come through and if you remember back from yesterday or the day before when we were down south all those reeds will be green when we go back you can see all the shoots coming up um, no. Right. Now we're all next. <laughs> Just coming up to our well now, as you can see. Where that boat was? Yeah. yeah I think. Pardon? Yeah, I don't, I don't think he was looking where he was going. <laughs> Right, we'll just plop it in on here on the bend, we've only got to be here an hour. I'm going to turn the camera off because I can't do the bus. Rolf, Rolf! Is that the scene inside? Yeah, so you can move it, move it. No, no, it shows it's mine. Oh, that means domestic. Outside No. Right, anyway. Oops, I've seen they're going on a little trip, but the Little nature is their thing. And we're going to have a walk up. You know the secret garden here, but I'm not supposed to tell you about it. Uh, we're going to have a look at that. We're going to have a bit of a walk. And then we'll crack on and see where we end up. Well, they didn't look to be all this space when I just come, this just come in then, but anyway. So, we're looking for the secret garden. Christine's been there, done that. Bought the ice cream. So, so she's making, putting a little bit of stuff together for, for breakfast using the artisan little loaf that she bought yesterday from the lady at Walmack. And we all had a Portuguese tart each. Well, actually, the adults did, the kids had the cookies. Um, just like a little custard tart, basically. Nice. Yeah, so. 
Anyway, doesn't look like the cottage is open. Well, it's a well kept secret because I can't find it. I can hear noises. It's got to be over there, isn't it? It's gotta be over them edges there, isn't it? The secret garden. I can hear people up there, I can hear. Well, that's a well trimmed bush, isn't it? Don't know where um, I can hear them. It's a secret garden, that's no secret anymore. the signs so if I can get back up again. This rose garden was renovated with a generous grant from the Norfolk Gardens Trust. It was officially opened in July 2017. Very nice. Let's have a look up here. Hmm. Which way to go? Obviously, I can't get lost with my inbuilt sat nav system. Trips over the roots. Can't go in there. I can hear him still. Looks me in the alley. On the lawn. Stuff only that way. Warm house guests and official visitors. Must be official visitor. Oh, see, so not even in the secret gardens. I knew it was up here. I knew it was up there to the left. Hmm. I'll go and break it to them. Gardens via Out Hill Wood. 
we have kept it very secret because we thought it was in the secret gardens. 10p for a me through the gate. You're a 10p. Thank you. I'm not paying. <laughs> Declan, come on. <laughs> there we are. Please shut it. No idea where I'm going. All the trees look the same. Sat and had malfunctioned. There was an arrow pointing in the opposite direction. I've never been down here before either. It's ten o'clock. Look at the breakfast on the go, get to gear stave. See what they want to do. Look. We found it. Oh yeah, I don't know, I forgot to wait up. Gotta go all the way we've gotta go all the way back up there to go out. What? We've got to go all the way back up there. To get out, this is it here. But the sign there says way out. We've got to, where we've just come in. I think we've got to go all the way back up that way. Come here. Was that not the, the garden? No, this is it. I think this is the second garden I've been through thinking this is the secret garden. No, this is it now here. Strictly no pond dipping. Mm, that sounds interesting. <laughs> no, they just ask for donations. There's the box. Twelve. The upkeep. Yeah, Kim. On the top of the wire. Yeah. See them bugs that are crawling around? Kim. In a minute. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, 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 Yesterday, when I was at the King's Arms, Eliza, I found a friend called Jack, and they live around here somewhere, Stalham I think they said. And, ooh, it's a bit muddy. And she just asked, can Jack come and stay at our house? <laughs> I don't know where I'm going. There's only fish in these ponds. Well, if there was, it'd be an error not spot, wouldn't it? What's going on here? Something's appertaining down here. I think it might be the gate, but it's a garden. Let's go. 
Stop it. What's that noise? Better not go too far in, it might be a little bit too far for them to carry that one. John, 1983, three, I think, or 80 something, five. John and, yes, that's the first thing I spent. Right, I'm going to go back and have some breakfast. And hope that they're not all day. And there was going to be a way out down at the bottom so that we didn't have to walk all the way back up the hill. I see there's another little path there. I'm going to go exploring them all. Right, see where we are in a minute. Hmm. Now then, do we walk past? Yes, we walk past that. I'm near the exit then. Well. Leads it to the secret gardens. Yes, that's the bridge I walked over there. Tools you sat and have. Never fails me, never. Never fails me, that was. Yes, this is the place. I'm going to look at that map. Entrance. Alright. So I've virtually been all around that bit. There's still quite a lot more. Right. It's me, breakfast time. Yes, so we have to do, we do have to go back up there because we're signing a new access beyond this point reserved for field studies. Yep. There we go. You'd think you'd be able to get out over there, wouldn't you? Best not.
Mm. I could hear them behind me before. No, I can't. Have they gone back the way we came? Or have they just gone quiet? Quiet? Hmm? Oh, hang on. I can hear them now. Yeah. 25 past 10. Dogs welcome, but please leaves at this end and bags at this end and take them home. That's us, it's the other way, really. Long dawn horizon. It's no private boat. <coughs> I think it's just ice cream time. Hmm. Yeah. This what? Time for food. <laughs>